بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اهلا بكم في فيديو جديد من فيديوهات قناتنا انجليش فور ارابس النهارده ان شاء الله هناخد تكمله الوحده الثامنه الفيديو هتضمن اول جزء معاني كلمات انترتشينج 1 يونت 8 اكسرسايز فروم 7 تيل ذا اند هنبدا من اول اكسرسايز 7 لغايه الاخر الجزء الثاني هو عبارة عن شرح للكتاب Interchange 1 Unit 8 Part 2 الجزء الثاني من الوحدة التامنة Interchange 1 الجزء الثالث هيكون عبارة عن PowerPoint نشرح فيها درس الجرامر بتاعنا اللي هو عن Count Nouns و Non Count Nouns الأسماء التي تعد والتي لا تعد الأسماء المعدودة وغير المعدودة آخر جزء عندنا هو عبارة عن Workbook Unit 8 كلمات الورك بوك Let's start 7 Bark Makes a loud noise like a dog Yard a Space around the house Garbage Waste Trash Garbage Waste Trash Complaints Statements people make about problems Complaints Statements people make about problems Privacy A state of being alone Privacy A state of being alone To be alone Kids Children Loud Noisy Exercise 8 Downtown The business center of a city. Downtown, the business center. The business center of a city. Convenient, nearby, easy to find things. British, convenient, O, A. American, O, S, A sound. British, O, O. Convenient, British, American, convenient. Nearby, easy to find things. Parking, place to park the car. Parking, a place to park the car. Safe, not dangerous, without crime. Safe, not dangerous, without crime. Hold on, hold on. Link between the D and O. خلي بالنا في هنا وصلة. Link ما بين حرف D وحرف O. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. T soft D. Wait a. Wait a minute. An apartment. A flat. Are there? Exercise nine. Are there many plus countable noun? Countable noun. A countable noun. Count noun. Are there many plus countable noun? How many plus countable noun? How many plus countable noun are there? How many plus countable noun are there? Is there much? Is there much plus uncountable noun? Uncountable noun, non-count noun. Is there much plus non-countable noun or uncountable noun? How much? How much plus uncountable noun? How much plus uncountable noun is there? How much plus uncountable noun is there? Little, little, t soft d. Opposite, much, little, much. Quantifiers. Quantifiers are used to describe different amount of things, such as a lot, a few, any, many, much, none. Quantifiers are used to describe different amounts of things, such as a lot, few, any, many, much, none. Crime. A, a crime, one crime, a bad deed. Killing is a crime. Killing 
is a crime. To kill someone is a crime. Killing is a crime. Traffic. Traffic is non-count noun. Traffic is a non-count noun. Traffic is a non-count noun. Parking is a non-count noun. Exercise 11. Won't add. Wanna add. Won't. Wanna. Wanna add. Vacancy advertisement. A vacancy advertisement. App apartment. Flat. خلينا ندور اختصار لكلمة apartment app بكتب بس في الإعلانات لما أكتب إعلان ولا حاجة بنحاول نحن نكتب عدد حروف أقل عشان ما ندفعش فلوس كتير note in ad in advertisement articles such as a an and the ver and the verb be are usually not included لما باجي بكتب إعلان ونشيل أدوات النكرة زي الآ والآن والزا ونشيل فيرب تو بي إكسرسايز 12 This is the passage Sidewalks Sidewalks American British Walks Sidewalks Sidewalks Pavements Pavements or pavements places next to the street where people walk sidewalks pavements places next to the street where people walk crowded with full of band a group of musicians band a group of musicians a group of musicians blend mix truly Nearly. As surrounded by, have all around. Adopt, begin to use. Rents, money people pay to live in apartments. Money people pay to live in apartments. Roomy, with lots of space. Spacious, roomy, spacious. Roomy with lots of space, spacious. Long, long time, for a long time. Resident, resident, a person who lives in a place. Traditional, usual, traditional, usual. Greek, a person who lives in Greece. Greece is a country. Tortillas, this word, not English word, this is name, this is a Mexican name. Tortillas, Mexican pancake, a Mexican pancake. Tortillas, Mexican pancake. Mexican pancake made with eggs and corn flour. Cara, character, characterist, characteristics, characteristics, features. Characteristics, features. Characteristics, features. Multicultural, multicultural, cosmopolitan, having different cultures. Multicultural, cosmopolitan, having different cultures. Exercise seven, unit eight. Part 2 Interchange 1 Exercise 7 Snapshot Come and complain about neighbors If you have neighbors Do you have complaints? Statements about problems Complain Complaints To tell problems About people General complaints General problems about your neighbors. Neighbors, people who are living next to you. Next by inhabitants. Number one, 
Look at the picture. Dog. The dog makes a lot of noise. The dog barks. And this is night. Noise. My neighbor's dog barks all night. My neighbor always has loud parties. Noise. My neighbor's dog barks all night. My neighbor always has loud parties. Look at the picture here. You see what people are singing, dancing. We have a lot of noise. This is night. Second picture, privacy. The problem of privacy. The kids here are playing in the yard. This is the yard, the house yard. They're picking up the flowers. They're having fun. Another kid, another child is what is listening. Is listening to his neighbors. He's spying. The kids next door always play in my yard. They play in the yard. My neighbor visits every day. It's too much. Every day, my neighbor comes. He knocks the doors. And visits me every day. Third problem. A lot of cats. A lot of cats. Animal problems. My neighbor's cats go everywhere. The cats go everywhere. My neighbor has six dogs. It's a zoo. My neighbor has six dogs. So this is like a zoo. Problem number four. Look at the picture. House. Not clean. The yard is not clean. A lot of mess. Chaos. Garbage. Cleanliness. My neighbor has garbage in his front yard. So my neighbor has garbage in his front yard. My neighbor never cuts the grass. My neighbor never cuts the grass. He didn't cut the grass. The grass. He never uses landscaper to landscape the garden, to make the garden clean. First question. Do you ever have any of these complaints? Which ones? Do you have any of these problems? Which one do you have? Noise. The street is always noisy. There are a lot of cars. It's too crowded. Animal problems. My neighbor has different watching dogs. Cleanliness. Some people threw the garbage in the street. What do you do when you have complaints? If you have a problem like this, what would you do? If I have a problem, I'll call the police. Exercise number eight. Look at the picture. What do you see? A young lady. Where is she? She's in the balcony. She's calling someone. She has a telephone, a mobile, a cell phone. Cell phone, mobile. She's talking to someone. What's the view? 
a lot of cars, street, different buildings, barber shop, coffee shop, and she's very happy. Conversation is pretty safe, pretty, pretty safe, very safe. Listen, Brax. Let's start to listen. Page 53, exercise 8, conversation. It's pretty safe. Listen and practice. How do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's downtown, so it's very convenient. Downtown? Is there much noise? Oh no, there isn't any. I live on the fifth floor. How many restaurants are there near your place? A lot. In fact, there's an excellent Korean place just around the corner. What about parking? Well, there aren't many parking garages, but I usually find a place on the street. Is there much crime? No, it's pretty safe. Hold on. That's my car alarm. I'll call you back later. Listen again. Listen and practice. How do you like your new apartment? I love it. It's downtown, so it's very convenient. Downtown? Is there much noise? Oh no, there isn't any. I live on the fifth floor. How many restaurants are there near your place? A lot. In fact, there's an excellent Korean place just around the corner. What about parking? Well, there aren't many parking garages, but I usually find a place on the street. Is there much crime? No, it's pretty safe. Hold on. That's my car alarm. I'll call you back later. First question. What about Nick and Bam? What are they talking about? They're talking about Pam's new apartment. Pam has moved a new apartment. Where is Pam's new apartment? It's downtown. So it's very convenient. Convenient, suitable. Nearby. Is there much noise? No, there isn't any. Why? Because Bam lives on the fifth floor. Her apartment is on the fifth floor. Apartment flat. How many restaurants are there near, near her flat? A lot. But the best restaurant is a Korean. It's a Korean restaurant. There's an excellent Korean place just around the corner. What about parking? There aren't many parking garages. There aren't many parking garages. But Pam usually finds a place on the street. Is there much crime? Crime here doesn't mean a crime, one crime, no. Crime means criminology. Is the place safe or not safe? Secure or not secure? في إجرام كتير في المنطقة يعني أو no, it's pretty safe. It's very safe. What happens during the phone call? During the phone call, Pam hears her color alarm. So she hang up. She hang up the phone. It means that the new neighborhood is not safe. Exercise 9. Grammar focus. Quantifiers. How many and how much? Count nouns. Are there many restaurants? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. 
How many restaurants are there? There are ten or twelve. Non-count nouns. Is there much crime? Yes, there's a lot. Yes, there's a little. No, there isn't much. No, there isn't any. No, there's none. How much crime is there? There's a lot of street crime. Listen again. Page 54. Exercise 9. Grammar focus. Quantifiers. How many and how much? Count nouns. Are there many restaurants? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. How many restaurants are there? There are ten or twelve. Non-count nouns. Is there much crime? Yes, there's a lot. Yes, there's a little. No, there isn't much. No, there isn't any. No, there's none. How much crime is there? There's a lot of street crime. Exercise 9. Quantifiers. How many and how much? Count nouns. Count nouns? Nouns that I can count. 1, 2, 3, 4. Are there many? Are there many restaurants? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. So answer? A lot? Few. No? No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. So no, not many. Not any. None. Any in negative. How many restaurants are there? After how many? Count noun. How many plus a count noun? How many restaurants are there? There are 10 or 12. Count nouns. Restaurants like restaurants, cars, pens, chairs. Non-count nouns. Things I can't count. Example, parking, noise, traffic, pollution. So pollution is non-count noun. Traffic is non-count noun. Non-count noun, we don't put S. Count noun, they have S like restaurants, cars. Non-count nouns, no S. Is there much crime? Yes, there is a lot. Yes, there is a little. Question, much. Is there much plus non-count noun? Yes, there is a lot. Yes, there is a little. T sub D. No, there isn't much. No, there isn't any. No, there is none. Yes, no question. Is there much? Plus nine count noun. You have yes or no. Five answers. All are correct. How much crime is there? How much plus nine count noun? How much crime is there? There's a lot of street crime. Let's see this PowerPoint presentation. How many and how much? Count nouns and non-count nouns. Countable nouns and uncountable nouns. Count nouns, pens, cars, chairs, computers, computers. Count nouns, we have S, plural, I can count 1, 2, 3. Non-count nouns, rice, water, coffee, tea. These are non-count nouns, count and non-count nouns. Count nouns, count nouns, count nouns or countable nouns are nouns that I can count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 they have plural with S they have plural club, clubs a bus, buses 
restaurant, restaurants. A car, cars. Count noun, count nouns have plural with s or es. Are there many? Are there many supermarkets around here? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Are there many? Plus, count now. Are there many supermarkets around here? Are there many cinemas around here? Are there any movie theaters around here? Are there any malls around here? Answer, yes, there are a lot. Many becomes a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. So I have here five answers. All of them are correct. Are there many? Are there many plus a count noun? Count noun, countable noun. Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Many? Question. Answer. A lot. A few. Negative, not many, not any, none. Are there many plus count now? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Are there many? Are there many plus a count noun? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are a few. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Many in question. Answer, a lot, a few, not many, not any, none. How many? How many plus count noun? How many students are there? There are 10. There are 10 students. How many students are there? That means how many students are in the class? There are 10 students. How many plus count noun are there? Answer, there are plus number. Like 10, 12, 15. How many flats? are in the building there are 20 flats there are 20 apartments flats apartments non-count nouns non-count nouns or uncountable nouns uncountable nouns non-count nouns Nouns that I can't count. I can't say one, two, three, four. Water. You can't count water. Parking. Parking. Traffic. Crime. Crime here doesn't mean a ah, crime, like killing is a crime. No. Crime means criminology. Igrom. مش معناها جريمة واحدة الإجرام. So non-count nouns are nouns that I cannot count. I can't count. Like water, crime, traffic, parking.
Non count nouns plus a singular verb. I say traffic is or traffic are, parking is or are, water is or are, pollution, noise is or are. After non count noun, we have a singular verb is, traffic is, parking is, water is. Noise is, pollution is, pollution. Is there much? Is there much plus non count now? Is there much noise in your neighborhood? Is there much noise in the street? Is there much noise in Cairo? Yes, there is a lot. Yes, there is a little. No, there isn't much. No, there isn't any. No, there is none. Question, much, answer, a lot, little, not much, not any, none. The rule is there much plus non count noun. Answer yes, there is a lot. Yes, there is a little. No, there isn't much. No, there isn't any. No, there is none. Much question answer a lot, a little, not much, not any, none. How much? How much? Plus non count now. How much noise is there? There is a lot of noise. How much plus non count noun is there? There is a lot. There is a little. You can say a lot, too much, a little, small amount. How much? How much noise is there? There's a lot of noise. How much plus non count noun is there? There's a lot, there's a little. Take care. There is difference between how much does it cost? This is to ask about the price. But here, say, how much noise? How much pollution? How much traffic is there? This is for non-count nouns. خلي بالنا إن how much بتيجي معنا كم للسعر. How much does it cost? What's the price? أنا بتكلم هنا عن how much اللي بيجي بعديها non-count noun اسم لا يعد. How much? How much noise is there? There's a lot of noise. How much plus non count noun is there? There is a lot. There is a little. A little T soft D. A little. There is a little T soft D. Now, A. Write answer to these questions about your neighborhood. Then practice with a partner. We have here different questions. You have different answers, many answers. Let's answer the questions. One. Are there many apartment buildings? Yes. Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are many. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Number two. How much traffic is there? There is a lot, there is a little, there is none, there isn't much, there isn't any. Question number three. How many dance clubs are there? There are a lot. There are few. 
There are none. There aren't many. There aren't any. Question number four. Is there much noise? Yes. Yes, there is a lot. Is there much noise? Yes, there is a lot. No, there isn't any. No, there isn't much. No, there is none. No, there isn't much. Question number five. Are there many pay phones? Yes, there are a lot. Yes, there are many. No, there aren't many. No, there aren't any. No, there are none. Question number six. Is there much pollution? Yes, there is a lot. No, there isn't any. No, there isn't much. No, there is none. No, there isn't much. Question number seven. How many swimming pools are there? There are a lot. There are a few. There are none. There aren't many. There aren't any. Question number seven, I can say, there are five swimming pools. I can make a number. Is there much parking? Yes, there is a lot. No, there isn't any. No, there isn't much. No, there is none. No, there isn't much. B. Group work. Write questions like those in part A about these topics. Then ask and answer the questions. In this question, you make questions about cafes, crime, parks, pollution, public transportation, schools, traffic lights. Example, cafes. How many cafes are in your street? There are four cafes. There are a lot. Is there much crime in your neighborhood? Yes, there is. Is there much crime in your neighborhood? Yes, there's a lot. Yes, there's a little. Parks. Parks? Like Dream Park. A very big garden for public to have fun. Are there many parks around here? Yes, there are. Yes, there are a lot. Is there much pollution? Yes, there is. Yes, there is a lot. Is there much public transportation? Public transportation, none count now. Is there much public transportation? Yes, there is a lot. Schools. How many schools are here? There are a lot of schools. There are 10 schools. Writing. Read this bulletin board ads asking for roommates. Now here, let's read this advertisement. This advertisement to ask for roommate. Roommate, someone who is living in a room who shares the rent, to share the rent. So every month, if the rent is $1,000, you pay 500 and your roommate pays 500. Roommate needed to share large three bedroom apt, apt apartment in nice neighborhood, great park across the street, only $440 a month, parking available, call Cherry or Jen at, at 352-555-8381. In this ad, great park, so I should say there is a great park across the street. 
a nice neighborhood. It's a nice neighborhood. Please call Sherry or Jane at blah blah blah. You will be only $440 a month. Parking is available. So there isn't verb to be. There isn't a or an. So an advertisement we remove a an verb to be and write an abbreviation like telephone tell T E L apt apartment why for not paying a lot of money in writing the advertisement exercise 12 12 reading the world in one neighborhood look at the picture here what do you see kids children these are what's this it's a sidewalk what's this it's a sidewalk a sidewalk, pavement, pavement, sidewalk, sidewalk, pavement, pavement, a place where people walk. Scan the article, then check through the countries that are not mentioned. Brazil, China, India, Japan, Pakistan. Romania, Thailand. Let's read. What's this? It's a map. Brooklyn, Queens, Austria, New Jersey. So, this is part of the USA. Austria is a neighborhood in Queens in New York City. So, Austria is a neighborhood in Queens in New York City. It's in the USA in New York City. What's Austria? Austria. Not Australia, Austria. The sidewalks are crowded with Indian women in colorful traditional dress. So the sidewalks, the pavements, these are the sidewalks, full of Indian women. And they're wearing colorful traditional dress. The traditional dress is the sari. It's called sari. A woman on the corner is selling Chinese cakes. A woman is selling Chinese cakes. A new song from a Romanian band is playing in a restaurant. Some musician from Romania are playing in a restaurant. Is it India? Is it China? Romania? No. It's Austria. Austria, a neighborhood in Queens, New York City. Austria was once a mostly Greek neighborhood. Greek neighborhood? Most of people who are living in it were from Greece. But the area is changing fast. New residents from India, Pakistan, Thailand, China, and all over the United States are moving in. New people came from different countries in the USA to live in this, in this wonderful neighborhood, Austria. So they have different nationalities in Austria, there are different nationalities in Austria. There are different people. Different cultures. So, where is Austria? Austria is in Queens, in New York City. Is Austria changing? Yes, Austria is changing fast.
Why? Because new residents from India, Pakistan, Thailand, China and all over the United States are moving in. Because different people from different countries came to live in, to live in Austria. The new residents, residents, inhabitants, people who came to live in Austria, the new residents bring many traditions. The new residents bring many traditions. These traditions blend together to make Austria truly multicultural. Paragraph 2 The new residents bring many traditions. Traditions, habits, customs, habits, these traditions blend together to make Austria truly multicultural. These habits mix together to make Austria multicultural, an area with different cultures, different nationalities, different people from all over the world. So they have different cultures. When people are surrounded by different cultures, they adopt the things that they like. When people have different cultures, they take the things that they like, says one resident. Here in Austria, it's not surprising that an Indian woman buys Mexican tortillas from a Korean grocery store. The seller is an Indian woman. The store or the shop, Korean shop. The product, Mexican tortillas. Tortillas, Mexican pancake. It's one of the things that makes the neighborhood special. This is why Austria is special. Three. Three, it's not surprising that Austria is becoming a very popular place to live. Austria is becoming a very famous place to live. The rents are reasonable. The rents are okay. What means the rents? The rents, every month, if you hire a flat, if you rent a flat, you pay the rent every month. The neighborhood is safe. It's safe. There isn't much crime. And it has very good public transportation. There is good public transportation. There are different buses. Subway. There are inexpensive stores. Inexpensive, not expensive. Not expensive shops. Many nice restaurants and good fresh fruit and vegetables. So in Austria, there are a lot of good things. Very good public transportation. The rents are reasonable. There are cheap stores, cheap shops, many nice restaurants, fruit and vegetable markets. Austria is a comfortable place. And Austria is a comfortable place to live. Apartments are usually big and roomy. The flats the apartments are big and roomy. They are not small. As one long time resident says, why live in where else? Austria has it all. So why would you like to live in a different place? If Austria has it all, why will you live in another place? Let's answer the questions. One moment, try to answer. Read the article, then write the number of each paragraph next to its main idea. Here, you have the idea, the main, okay, and you search. What is the main idea of each paragraph? How can we know the main idea? To know the main idea, read the beginning of any paragraph and the end, the introduction and the conclusion. The first sentence is the main sentence.
The last sentence is the conclusion. Number one. The new residents make Austria a multicultural neighborhood. Multicultural, different cultures, different nationalities. So this is what paragraph number, paragraph number two. Paragraph number two. The new residents bring many traditions. Traditions, customs, cultures. These traditions blend together to make Austria truly multicultural. People from all over the world are moving to Austria. This is paragraph number, paragraph number one. We have here different nationalities. At the end, and all over the United States are moving in. The neighborhood has many good characteristics. Characteristics, features. Here it has different features, different characteristics, such as what? Public transportation, the rents are reasonable, inexpensive stores, nice restaurants, good fresh fruit and vegetable markets. So all of these are characteristics, qualities, adjectives, features. B. Check through the things you can find in Austria. In Austria there are inexpensive stores, not expensive stores, cheap stores or reasonable stores, reasonable shops, big apartments, big flats. great markets, nice restaurants, many different cultures, good public transportation. See, do you know of a neighborhood that's similar to Austria? Describe it. Do you know any place like Austria, a place with different nationalities, with different cultures, with different habits. Yes. Sharm el Sheikh is like Austria. In Sharm el Sheikh, you'll find different tourists, different nationalities from all over the world. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and don't forget to subscribe. شكرا للمشاهدة من فضلك اشترك في القناة لتصلك آخر إصداراتنا